Hey, how's it going guys? Back again, and we're gonna be opening up another Blue Sky stream because the first one was just too good. And um, yeah, I mean, today feels like a good day to go for another one. So the first one, we were able to get the Rayquaza alternate art. I really want the dragon in alternate art. So here's hoping that maybe we can snag out another really nice hit. Um, so far, I've been really enjoying this set and um, really looking forward to the fusions coming out. And then, I mean, all in all, it's been a really fun time for me in the hobby. And I've just been having a fun time collecting. Uh, let me know in the comments if you're feeling the same way. That being said, let's crack right into some of these packs. Now, uh, if you did see the video before, we had already um, finished out majority of the set. I think we were only missing the two Gyarados and the Metacham V. So, in actuality, what we only really need is that secret. So once we pull the secret, we are done for this box. I actually get to keep one of these sealed packs for my own personal um, sealed collection and graded. So that's going to be pretty sweet. Here's hoping that we can pull it fairly early. And then maybe if we are even luckier, we can pull out some copies of the Rayquazas um, for graded purposes outside of the binder collection. So I think we're just gonna grab one and get right into it. How's everyone doing today? Uh, it's uh, Saturday, about to be Sunday. And so far the weekend's been all right. And then into our first pack. Let me know in the comments below if um, if this format is good, if it's uh, aesthetically okay, or if there's any suggestions as to how I can go about making better content. So we're into Standler, Sandshrew, Sima Sage, and Zinnia. Okay, so next pack. Here's hoping because I, I really, I really like the Rayquazas in this set and I really like Dragonite. Okay, one to the front. Okay, Energy, Shelter, Minin, Hopip, and Flaffy. Okay. Now I do also intend to keep a sealed booster box in my sealed collection. I, I just really like the um, the booster box artwork, period. I think I like that right there. Okay. Pack number three, what do you have for us? Okay, Terminator. Sand Slash. Hands here. Up it and scroll. Okay, definitely not going to be keeping this pack, so... Pack number four. I really got it. I know I got to get better lighting, though. Okay, Marip, pop it. And there we are. That is really nice. I am looking so forward to having this one graded and added to my collection and being able to keep my binder collection. Okay, so that's one of the gold cards secured. And now we still just have to pull out the Dragonite 
USB, which would be nice. So Dragonite V would be nice. Um, any alternate art, any secret rare, full art trainer. Okay, Raygun, Sizzlepi, Boltoy, Tropius, and no hit. Okay, let's see. I like this one. Okay. We got Hempros. Voltix. Manitan. Sinisage. And oh, we have a hollow Salamence. Oh. Yeah, he's another one that I, I, I want taken care of and graded so you know what e count um don't like how bad this pack looks so we're gonna just get into this one <clears throat> This Senna Scorch artwork. Okay. Kaplan, Ball Toy, Bagon, and we have Trevenant V Max. That's an okay hit, but not what we are looking for. But if from what our first box taught us, we're almost guaranteed to get one of most if not majority of the set so it's to be expected i'm just hoping that we can keep mo like for sure keep one of these packs um sealed and it would suck if the last pack is for sure our secret for the booster because then i have to crack it open <clears throat> Great Ball, Shellgon, Plus Old Cragnal, and Flapple. So if we remember right, it was close to the last pack that had the major hit. So maybe it's on the bottom. I wonder if that's a thing. Appleton, Darmanitan, Hoppit, uh, skip off. sorry, Sizzlepeed, and Popsicle, maybe it's one of these, I'm, I'm willing to put it, that it's one of these. Okay, we got a pair of gloves. This is the Bag on. Hop it, and we have Landorus. Not a huge fan, but it is a hit. A hit's a hit. You can show behind Salamence there. Um, it's taking longer than I thought it would to get this hit, hit out. I was hoping just for a handful of packs and we would be alright. Oh, we got a hollow. Ladle, Shogun, Hand Sage, Zygarde.
Okay, we got Zinnia, Nine Tails, another artwork that I really like. Shauna, Shelter, and Oyster. This is honestly a lot of packs, and I'm surprised that it's taking this long. We're almost halfway through the box by now. What is going on with these packs? Okay. Okay. Okay, well then. Lizzie, we have a hollow, but Dragon type, let's see. Call a dragon, Reggie Drago? Yeah, Reggie Drago. Stadium, Sanchu, Simisir, Chansey, non hollow hit. The heck are these packs? Switch, Shauna, still full, Dharamaka, and we have Trevenant V. That's nice. It does give us um, viable cards to actually play with, I suppose. Okay. Definitely going through or skipping more packs than I thought it would to actually get to the hit. Okay, and we have Santa Scorch, Terramaka, C, Sandshrew, and Terrifying Mask. Now remember, once we do pull the secret from this booster, we are going to call it there. But this is another reason why I really like the Japanese sets. Because, as you can see, we already have six pulls. And, I mean, that's, that's just really nice. But with the English sets, it's typically a lot harder. There's a lot more cards to the set and the pull rates are just dismal compared to the Japanese sets okay beware Chansey plus soul and we have Volcarona another really nice artwork actually I, I really enjoy he he was my main in the uh, sword and shield games and I am actually stoked to have this copy so I can send this one as well to get graded. Volcarona is one of those that I feel doesn't get nearly enough recognition. It is a solid Pokemon. Its speed stats are just really good, especially if properly uh, trained up. Okay, so we have a pair of gloves, skip bloom, Shelter, Trainer, and non hollow hit. <clears throat> okay. We only have a handful of packs left, and it is looking like it's going to be longer than I thought to actually get to the main hit non-hollow hit so we have 
five. About 11 more packs. I like this one. Okay, butchering these packs. Put one to the front. Okay, we got a scroll, semisphere, shoulder, sand slash, and sent to scorch. Watch it be one of these. Okay, and regardless, I, I was looking for the Rayquaza. I'm super happy to have that one. So overall, opening this box is still a win for me. And we have a Fighting V. I think this is the Medicham B, and indeed it is. So, now I have a Medicham V for play, and one for the Binder Collection. That's actually a nice have. Um, 10 packs now, this one definitely took a lot I'm really hoping to just pull the secret and then be done. <clears throat> okay, face mask, mining, Daramaka, and we got the oh my word. Okay, well this is gonna be our secret and I am super happy with this one as well. I, I guess I guess the green snake likes us guys because I mean I wasn't I wasn't hoping for this guy but I was hoping for the Dragonite but we got the Rayquaza full art centering looks looks okay but I'm gonna call it there gives us eight packs you know what we only need to save one. No, but this is our, our secret rare. Hmm. I can't think of anything else in the set that I would like a duplicate of. Maybe the Dragonite V? But is that really necessary? You know what, let, let me sleeve this guy up first. Okay, so we have eight packs left. And... We just, I mean, honestly, all we're missing is the alternate VMAX artwork. And we have all the Rayquazas, so. And I highly doubt that one of these boxes would have duped, like, a double secret hit in it. But maybe, just maybe... That's actually really nice. I like that. Hmm. That is a beautiful card. I'm not sure if the camera does it any justice. But you know what? I think... What I'm going to do is... We're going to just open up... The three on the right and leave the five on the left. And I'm just gonna send in the five on the left for just preservation and grading purposes. Okay, so we got Plaffy. Toxel, Stantler, Applin, Great Ball. At, at this point, I cannot complain. The Japanese set has, again, as always, taken really good care of me, and I am super grateful to have this V card. 
in my collection. Okay, Shauna, Bagon, Marit, and Holotoxtricity. Thanks again for tuning in, guys. I really appreciate the support. Be sure to subscribe. Let, let me know in the comments if you have any suggestions as to how to better make content for you folks. And um, also, if there are any sets that you have uh, in your sites that you would like to see open, diagonal. Okay, and the last card for today is going to be a hollow hit electric type. I'm thinking Reggie Alecki. And indeed it is. This is a wonderful, wonderful box opening. Super stoked to have this guy in my collection. And um, look forward to having him as well as the other Rayquaza graded. Because I just really like the artwork. And it is indeed a beautiful card. This VMAX just looks really really nice and now we have the full art and if you give me one moment I'll show you what the um, previous hit was so we have I would say the three desirable of the green dragons omitting the only insane VMAX alternate artwork. But in my opinion, I think this guy looks way, way better with that texturing of the sun. But thanks for tuning in, guys. I'll catch you next time. Happy hunting.